Pouring numbers like equations Trench talk When you jump up off the porch as a youngin And start posting on the block with the junkies And get it bouncing What's good, what's good, ladies and gentlemen? Everybody out there, go down to that description box right now, man. Come support your boy, man. We get, we, we got a strong and powerful movement right now. When you go down to that description box, man, you're going to find a lot of amazing things that you need in your life right now, man. Go check out the description box right now. Check out my links. Anyway, man, let's talk about it, man. Carmelo Anthony, man. Lala Anthony, man, calling the quits. Lala, everybody know, went down and filed a divorce, man. Now... As I did my research on this, man, and I'm finding out, I didn't, like, I'm not a Carmelo fan or uh, Anthony fan or nothing like that. I don't really check him on. I'm a LeBron guy, Kyrie guy, Jimmy Butler guy. You know what I'm saying? These are the guys I watch in the NBA. I don't really watch no Melo or nothing. I never was a Melo fan, but to find out that he had all these mysteries and all these kids all over the place, I'm like, well, I'm talking about, I'm seeing pictures and, it, and the babies look just like Melo. I'm like, Lordy, so stripper here, stripper there. So I'm guessing like they had the thing when he was on the yacht and he got caught with that. Now they have it multiple places now that he getting caught at. And I'm trying to figure out what the heck is going on with Carmelo, man. So he out here sleeping with the whole entire world. I mean, he is an NBA ball player, you know what I'm saying? So I guess the, that's the lifestyle they live, man. But it's messy right now man so i'm guessing like i said a lot of times people say they're gonna go file i think tiny said she was gonna file on ti at one time and i remember a lot of saying she was gonna file a bat when the when the pictures floated all over the internet i think the most funniest thing about carmelo is this right when he get caught and he's caught red-handedly right and they got pictures he still do tmz interviews and and say i did it wasn't it was just my friend and whoop the whoop it's like, bro, that got to be the most, man, look, it just looked crazy because everybody in the world know that's not just your friend and we know there's something else going on. And it, I'm going to tell you how the people know, right, Carmelo, if he watching or anybody else watching, bro, how do we know that, that you cheating or messing with somebody else? And how we, how is it that? Because Lala is filing for the divorce every time these situations explode over the internet. So it's letting all everybody know that it's not just some friend. You right? Like so it's like it's this common sense. Like, like oh how does Shade Room know this or how this person know that? And not just that, you got Kevin Garnett coming out talking about La La tastes like Cheerios and stuff like that. So you got all these different stories. Then the Mano story came out with fifty and everybody already knew about this. Sorry, Uncle Murder, everybody knew about it already. You know what I mean? Then his old lady went to spill the beans, I guess over some jealousy or her and Mano had a little falling. No, but she spilled the beans all over the internet. I mean, but like I say, the story's been around about both of them having little affairs and things of that nature. And like I say before, you Camaro can't lie about none of these situations because the kids look just like them. Now, it ain't nowhere in the world that you have kids that look that much like you and try to deny it. You know what I mean? You just got to man up. I mean, like I say before, I feel like somebody like Carmelo is better off being single. You feel what I'm saying? Like it ain't even no point, right, to even try to do that you know what i mean yeah i just feel like he should just be a single bachelor man you feel what i'm saying enjoy his life enjoy all his kids he's doing the uh whoop chamberlain right there like, like 100 kids or something <laughs> he's doing a whoop chamberlain out here that's a basketball player lifestyle you dig what i'm saying i just think marriage ain't for everybody man you know what i'm saying come with a lot of things man and like i say every marriage is have deep dark secrets and stuff like that we just seen the will, will and jada thing come out in the public like that but you know, everybody ain't conditioned to go through these situations and keep moving forward. You know what I mean? Like I say, Tiny and T.I. had that whole explosion all over the internet. They dealing with stuff still right now. But like I said, more information came out, more kids coming out. You know what I mean? I just found out Nick Cannon had more kids, man. I'm like, they shooting them out. I mean, they making the millions. They could do what they want. You feel me? As long as they taking care of their responsibility. I think with Carmelo and I think Lil Dirt too, they had a... Hey, the old article on Lil Dirt having the, uh, some kids on the side, too. So they got Lil Dirt. They got uh, Nick Cannon. And now they got my man Carmelo Anthony in this scandal now, man. This is it's wild and crazy. But like I said, it's, some people ain't just built for it. I just feel like Nick Cannon probably better just being a single bachelor. Same with Carmelo Anthony. And the same probably with Dirt. You know what I mean? Just live your life. Enjoy your life. You know what I'm saying? And marriage ain't for everybody, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you could love somebody, but don't have to put no ring on it. Just keep everything copacetic because I feel like this, right? Put the ring on the person's finger. 
they they gonna want the loyalty, the respect, the honor. They gonna want all of that. You know what I mean? Then you're not giving them that, and then you end up in these bad predicaments like that. You know what I'm saying? So I just feel like this is messy when everybody sees it all over the place. It's like I told you before, the social media era is deadly. It's nothing you can hide because it's so many people that want to talk. Back in the days, you would have these predicaments and situations and nobody would have a voice. Now you can literally get on Instagram, Facebook, and just put a post up. And then people from Shade Room, people from all these different outlets going to go up there and they're going to analyze it. How many times you been on Carmelo? They're going to have text messages, <laughs> pictures, and all that. But, you know, they try to sue you now. So they ain't going to do too much because, you know what I mean, all this... You know what I mean, lawyers and stuff like that. So, you know, they ain't gonna go too crazy with it. But having all these outlets is, is making the stories hit the fan a lot quicker than it would back in the days. A lot of these stories you would have never heard of back in the day. No social media, no internet, none of that. You wouldn't heard nothing about nobody else's kids unless somebody came out and said it and got on a big platform. But now then you could be on YouTube or any platform and just show pictures and DMs and all of that. And it be exposed all everywhere. So like I said before, man, I, I personally believe that bachelors, just be bachelors, leave it alone. That ain't for you. You see, Boosie said that Boosie came out. I ain't, I ain't marrying nobody. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Boosie straight up said, I ain't, man, I'm not gonna hurt no girl. I ain't gonna hurt break no girl heart. Just let it go, man. That's all I said, just let it go, man. Straight up. Hey, go down to the description box right now and come rock with all the new projects I'm doing right now. I want y'all to come out and support me. One of the description box, come check it out, man. See what fit you. You know what I mean? And then come join in with the team. You dig? I'm out. Love y'all. Hey, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit that like button. And when you hit that notification bell, it will always let you know every time that I upload new content.